So I'm going to take you through how to do your um, caliper measurements for your belly and your quad that you can do on your own and then the glute ham tie-in that or hamstring if you want to call it that that you will need someone else to do for you. So this is John Jack. He is a, um, a physique coach, uh, also my husband um, and he's been doing my uh, calipers for a long time, many years and my name is Michelle McDonald. I'm also a physique coach so I'll be walking you through how to do that. So this is the AccuMeasure and you can see it has a movable plastic part in the center. This is really important because this is what is going to allow you to take your own caliper um, without having to bend over, try to see what the reading is and, and therefore getting a lot of distortion in your, in your pinch. So I'm going to slide this right to the middle. Okay. I'll be observing when this pops into the little slot and the moment that does that I'm going to stop applying pressure. So um, I'm going to do my belly. I always do the same spot. So I will tend to collect body fat down here. So I go over about one inch to the right of my navel and then one inch down. And that's going to be where I'm uh, grabbing, the, uh, grabbing the pitch. I like to really go wide, about a nice two inch thickness. And then I, and then I just grab any subcutaneous fat. I can feel my fingertips sliding against the muscle wall of the abdomen. And I'm just pinching and pulling whatever um, subcutaneous fat I can get, okay? Now I'm going to anchor this arm right up against that skin fold, right? So this is the, I call this the non-moving part. I'm going to anchor that. And then with this arm, right, applying pressure on that little knob, I'm going to start to go in until I get right beside my thumb. And then I just apply some pressure until it goes in. And then I let go of everything. And then I read that. So I am at, looks like an eight millimeter pinch there. I'm gonna do two more measurements. That's an eight. And that's a six. So I'm gonna do one more pinch just to see what's happening. I'm looking for three, um, three pinches that are pretty much the same. So I had three eighths and one six. So I'm gonna say that six was a deviation. That six, I'm gonna throw that out. Maybe I press a little bit hard or my finger slipped or something like that. So, and then that's it. I mean, these are relatively accurate as long as it's the same person doing the measurement in the same spot at the same time of day. And you don't wanna put any more weight on the measurement than that. So um, if I'm doing my measurement, if I see that pinch going down over a two week period, then I've lost some body fat. If I see that pinch going up over a two week period, then I probably gain a little bit of, of, of body fat. Um, and so I might wanna look at my habits. Maybe I need to stop having a lick of uh, ice cream or something midweek. All right, quad you can also do. So again, I just slide that to the center. I always take mine, I go like this, very, very simple. And I have a little freckle there. So that's where I'm gonna take my pinch. I'm gonna take a vertical pinch. Same thing, I'm gonna anchor the non-moving hand, non-moving arm. I'm gonna go in there with the other one right beside my thumb and pinch and let go. So I've gone up to a 10, it looks like. I used to be an eight. So again, I have my little freckle, anchor, pinch, let go. That's a 10. One more time, pinch, let go, and that's a 10. So uh, that's it for those two areas, those two spots you can do on your own. Now the last one is the glue ham tying. You will need somebody to do that for you. Um, a personal trainer would be great. My husband is also my coach, so he's very good at doing this pinch. You slide the measurement to the center. You're gonna to wanna to come to the side, yeah. And you just a little bit of flexion in the hip, so just a slight tilt forward so he, um, the person can get in there. And I call this the glute ham tie-in. This can also be called the hamstring, um, the hamstring caliper. And he'll take three measurements. So the first one reads at 12. Twelve. Oh, it's really grabbing. <laughs> and twelve. All right. So that's it. So that's how you do those three measurements. You can do the belly and your quad on your own, um, and get a you know get a hot Fantastic. guy.
partner. To uh, do your, your glutes. <laughs>